Well guys, we finally got what we've been asking for. After Modern Warfare 3 and Black Ops 2, a lot of Call of Duty guys have been asking for dedicated servers and it looks like it finally freaking happened. Activision is finally listening to us. Dedicated servers will be on Call of Duty Ghosts, but right now it's only revealed for the Xbox One. Cricket, cricket, cricket noises, cricket, cricket. Nobody cares about Xbox One. <laughs> Just playing Microsoft, guys. You know I have to pick a bone with you. It's all love. You guys should know that by now. But anyways, what's going on, all my gamers out there? It's that one and only X Mother and Beast. And today, you guys are watching some of that new Super Mario Bros. U. Got some co op action going on here. I'm playing as Mario. My girl is playing as Luigi. And I think we end up dying a few times on this um, map right here, or this level, I should say. But you know, all in all, it was still good co op fun. Now, I know Mario isn't everybody's cup of tea on, my ch on this channel. I know some people, a select few people, only like it. But I literally had no gameplay left. I had no Last of Us, no Medal of Honor, no Call of Duty. I had nothing for you guys so you no know, this is gonna have to do for now anyway so if you don't enjoy the gameplay hopefully you still do enjoy the commentary and if you did don't hesitate to leave that thumbs up it always does help but anyways let's talk about the actual topic at hand call of duty ghost will have dedicated servers now a link will be in the description if you want to read this article yourself where it talks about call of duty um Ghost will have dedicated servers alongside with a new game mode, but pretty much I'm gonna read the beginning where it says Call of Duty Ghost will use Xbox One's cloud service that hosts dedicated servers. An Activision spokesperson announced today during Microsoft's GameCon press conference. Now, pretty much you know that thing that Xbox or Microsoft, I should say, has been bragging about their whole little cloud system, how it's gonna act like dedicated servers for some games and such. Well, it seems like Call of Duty Ghost is taking advantage of this and it's gonna be having dedicated servers with the cloud system. Now, this is great because, let's face it, lack compensation suck donkey balls. You know, that shit suck. It sucked Donkey Kong's freaking huge gorilla yeah, you know what? We're not even gonna get that detail, but that compensation sucks that damn bad. I hate it, lack compensation. I still do. I never even understand why it was in there. Well, I guess I do understand why it was implemented, but it just freaking sucks. I mean, let's face it, it's not good at all. Well, anyways, I think this is finally good because we're not gonna have no more of this horrendous wall lag shit or no more host advantage or disadvantage and things like that. Well, wall lag may still be in there, but um, you know, for the most part, we won't have any of the big lag issues that the game suffer from now. Which, of course, is always a good thing because people always complain about the maps and the lag. And since they're going to be having dedicated servers, lag shouldn't be too much of an issue. And all they need to do is get the maps and the perks done right. And Call of Duty Ghost should be a really good Call of Duty game, like a, a, the best one that we had in a while. I mean, it's hard to say now since we haven't played it. But, you know, if they get things done right, like having dedicated servers, that's already making me think it's going to come out good. But anyways, do I think Xbox One would be the only one to have dedicated servers? Of course not. I think from where Activision still, I believe, had the partnership with uh, Microsoft, they're going to you know, announce it first for the Xbox One so the Xbox One can look more pleasing in the customer's eyes and build Xbox One some more momentum, but I'm sure it's going to be out for PC and PS4 as well. As for the current gen systems, I don't think they're going to have it. Wii U, I'm not sure about. But anyways, you guys should comment below and let me know how you feel about this. And if you enjoyed the video, leave a thumbs up. I'll be talking to you guys later. Peace.